According to the National Bureau of Statistics, 67.5% of children in Nigeria are multidimensionally poor. This means that one in three children under five in Nigeria experiences severe food poverty, which can lead to life-threatening malnutrition. These children lack access to education, health, and better living standard. A resident of Oshogbo, Adebayo Abdurrahman, says child poverty is part of failure of government. The government can be blamed in the sense that they promise and fail all the time. And the promise and fail of the government is to bounce on the parents, where the parents will not be able to cater for their children. The time of feeding, pay the school fees, send them to a better school, and shelter them at the right time. But another resident of Oshobo, Akim Awobo, they says child poverty is caused by irresponsible parents. They don't care about what their children eat. They don't care when their children leave home for school. They don't even know whether their children go to school. So they are careless. There are some careless parents like that. So at the end of the day, you now see parents, who are student, children wandering around. They will be wandering around from one hand to another. So that is a problem. For Bolu Watife Ade Dokun, who also resides in Oshogbo, parents and government have complementary roles to play in addressing child poverty. Government cannot only solve it. It's the parents. The parents should find something to do. They should not leave their children. If you can give birth to them, then why can't you just look for a way to fend to fend for them? At least they should do something. They should work. If they cannot send them to private school, public schools are there. They can send them to public schools. So parents should try on their own part to make provision for their children. They all called on governments to take necessary steps to address child poverty in order to secure the future of children. Amid Oye Igbade, Trust TV News, Oshogbo.